ark. Salvation first. Ark. On the way to heaven. Osmani Morrison. This is Messenger Morrison. Yenya Bora Morrison and Upomlen dear. Now Momayan Tria Satanic Project and Crusade Part Two. Let's continue so. the topic about satanic project and crusade. Mia Iji Elekemi Ponuchole about some per dawn a problem part two. Satanic project and crusade. A ye jumedia one one so a brun some de sin and so any dia all bohu de rubo we are seeing yana. We're still talking about the satanic project and crusade, which is the part two. Milan Migale Jiga no pomula abo suffer don a proper popum lendia. Wunim was a po messenger Morrison and as osmani na. Me no entry as soon as I dear way. The number is 024770 I want you to WhatsApp or call me, Messenger Morrison, on 024770 so that we have an in depth teachings. Me diwena yom le undi anye pe mo kapo je se 024770 na yom le undi ane mi ponu cho abosan pe don. But more than that, we share some message we man. Nipeni na ensaka ensaka brisa many a brisa oma odipa ba kumpo e nyang kwaje. Please make sure to share this very video and audio and message as well so that a lot of people will get to know what the devil is about because he wants a lot of people to lose their salvation do you love salvation for your soul and whoever you are in love with do you also want the person to win her soul to be won in heaven then please share this message that is the satanic project and his crusade when jesus wanted to save the souls of people during the days of noah he called noah and gave him his message he made Noah to build the ark, which is the salvation ark. Noah this same Noah through which the ark of uh, salvation or the ark was being built I the question I want to ask right now is was he a son of the devil or the son of God so oyo onyan kupon ni padia and ya mema wati asese nyame so obeji obi ankon wasasi so a o de bafa nyame ni paso if it was a man of god then it means that if god wants to save someone's soul then it will be true a man of god nenye be onye no anye ma pa ama onye ya ke meje ma gbono le ndi ya be na amade akpo deda alo akpo jipo fere pe ma akwa to mo pe ameji abra na Israel for ewo Egypt Mizrim asase so Yakobon fa Moses when the Israelites were in Egypt God picked Moses time Israel view ono Egypt ma wa eyo enu ya odometo de ka na abro fa Moses say or the Moses e ko e ko di juma won won so eyi akra no and when God picked Moses to save the souls of people Eh ma wo yo mo se be na na mo no akpo deda okosi akode e ma mo de wo mpoma okosi akode e ma mo de wo mpoma eto fo ma ne dane owo he met challenges 
and made his stick turn into a snake. Eba dogo nu yi kenye nu kwe kamele moji. Eko dogo nu kwe kamele moji ya. Eba ati tore unya eko e dane e ozo e da. Sa ene, eno biya nyame asuma no poma e dane o wa. Yabe keso ya wain. If today the man of God has a stick and the stick is being turned into a, a snake, what would we term that man of God as? And so if through Moses God saved the people of Egypt from Israel, then I want you to know that if today people will also be saved, then it means God is going to do so through his men or man of God. I want you to consider the satanic project and crusade he's doing against the men of God. Satanic appointism. He has been able to introduce uh, what we call the satanic appointism. Now, sir, fre anasa a hand time fre pride appointism. And this pride appointism. If you really want to know what is all about, just WhatsApp Messenger Morrison. Or satanic workers, after introducing such, he has also brought about those who will be introduced into the satanic. We are introducing the satanic people into Christianity. Eh, o gale abo sanga numa wa eja agba voga di epe e dola o e ikenya abo sanga fe do wona o o le do wom le sofo dola me. Sisi a sanga krofwe i ena obisi oba power hon toma. These very people are those whom one person has decided to unveil their deeds. And the person has really done well, but what he's doing is also tarnishing the image them the image of the men of God to destroy what God wants and rather to promote satanic projects. If someone is going to have salvation, it will be through a man of God. It is through a man of God that people are going to listen to the word of God and have a total repentance. If the fear of God which helps a country to grow will take place, it is through a man of God. The economy of a country or my amen to If an economy of a country will grow very well, it all depends on a pastor. Elisha to Asurumu. Elijah closed the heavens such that there was no rain in Samaria. Samaria. 
And last year, at two G four, no, be a chime gaja le sa Maria. Eh, be any balaji. Mama pasa be mauti asen se se nyame nkrofu ni mu egu ase se nyame nkrofu ni na ase se nyame nkrofu ni na nya papa dia and yam fine and as a worker sa obeti all i want you to understand is that if the men of god are not as good as we see them then when they talk who will listen me dia ma bia me len dia na nya ma opa mo ka ta o monya nwe to le keke ya ma wa ke me ka we afu no emi ado to efifia and it me ma what ya se and the day se obron sam e ye crusade na o ye big project against man of god e we we ibrahim i just want you to understand in these last days that the devil has a satanic crusade and a satanic project me dia mi anya le e yi ke to me be e abo san o fe do ona lo bo popo pe ya wo mo la o le wo be ni wa gble mo o fe amo alo mo fe do or say a sophony na or go a sophony na any more. He's really tarnishing the image of all pastors. A bosan to be a blam off a amo kata, a to be a blown kata. Jesus and Cassassi, Yamanini na hambo munini ne endu chabre. Jesus himself said we should allow all to grow together until the day of harvest. Bible, when me name your Okata no achi, no achia, ne i ma dua mi angen kunweto. Matthew chapter thirteen verse thirty. According to Matthew chapter thirteen verse thirty. Le mata opak ban le ta wie ton kuku wie eh kuku blaton. Di anyame kene se. Man ko tutu ogufu ono abana weguno ayesa ube tutu papa nini na edi afra. God told the sower not to pull out all that the devil has planted, but he should allow them to grow together. Mau egbona nuku la la be me yi me ga yi tepe mano avade nuku egbona tone da sulo wakata nechi ne dua anga nyue tone eme. Na aso ena yesi ye yi yi asofu bono no efrimo eba ya den ene enko kan papa no. But today we have decided to uproot the bad pastors. Why wouldn't the good ones also be affected? Our social media now be tiho. No, our boss of Wadi, our boss of Wadi, and I say, Mete Danka Williams, Sidin, Mete Ajana Saridin, Mete Sam Quanchian Credin, Ah, Nipane Bobas of Fonidin Casa, anyhow. Ghana Pentecostal Council, Ghana Charismatic Council, Ghana Orthodox Council, Munina Moy. Just on social media yesterday, I heard someone mentioning. Duncan Williams, Ajinasari, Sam Kwanchian Christ, Men so and all the pastors' name and tarnishing their images. Where are the Pentecostal Council of churches, of churches today? Charismatic Council of Churches and where Orthodox. Are, where are they? Echo kebe me na de pom le Facebook le social media echo e o le so fo un ko yom le so fo un blem le e te pema me de ma bia mi le ndin ben fika charismatic tole fika mi afa fu ofo ta gan to fika o le o zi pi o le nu pom ne nyina ne se se wo se wo se ya so fo bi na wo yi aso fo okoko am nsam nyina pia ni pe bia ni mbu aso fo no ni pe bia ni fo aso fo asam nya asam the fact and truth is, if you have decided to unveil all these pastors, then let me let you know that even the good ones will be affected and people will not listen to what they say. If that should happen, how are you going to worship God and be a true Christian so you know God? Have you realized what we're experiencing in these last days just when rapture is at the corner? Satanic project and crusade. Mamma, I'm going to
Let me just come your way with the part three of the satanic project and crusade. Minama gabo yimako abosan fe don ala abosan wapu opebe doya makopatri kovana me. God bless you. Namisha munina.